Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 9th, August 9th. Um, this is a message from my guides. This reading is really not time specific, and it's not sign specific. We're just going to see what comes up. This reading may be for you, it may not. Keep in mind that, you know, the timing is fluid. All right, let's see what we got for the 9th. What do we have for the ninth? What do we have for the ninth? Ooh, chariot. Success that comes from dedication and self-discipline. Celebrating your accomplishments. Being in the spotlight. The chariot is also about, you know, putting yourself in the driver's seat to bring success. I mean, that's what it is. So somebody's dedication and self-discipline is putting them in the spotlight. This is also something moving forward very, very quickly. Um... Whatever is happening is going to bring success. <laughs> Fantastic. Somebody could be arriving very, very quickly. They could be, you know, showing up on your doorstep or you could be running into them somewhere. You know, you're in your car, you go to a store, you go somewhere and you run into somebody. Chariot, success that comes from dedication and self-discipline. You're headed in the right direction. Somebody is absolutely headed in the right direction. They may be moving, traveling, traveling to a new destination. Or they're tra somebody is traveling somewhere. And wherever it is that they're traveling to... could lead them to a successful something, whatever it is. Wheel of Fortune. Well, this is a change, of course. This is spinning the wheel. This is the wheel of fate. This is good luck. This is a lucky break. This is destined. There could be a, uh, this is like serendipity. Okay, it is. This is like a fortunate accident. Accident. Yeah, absolutely it is. So this is a change in direction. It is. It's a change in direction. Seven of Wands reversed. Two of Pentacles. Somebody's made some poor decisions. Yeah, they have. Somebody has made some really poor decisions. They may have acted out of character. They may, or they, maybe their character has changed. Maybe, maybe they're changing their character. The world reversed. There's some sort of unfinished business here. Unfinished business. I guess we're going to do it this way. Lack of closure, feeling of emptiness, but something is about to change. Seven of Wands reversed. There's, there's been some sort of maybe a misunderstanding. Ten of Cups. Somebody wasn't really focused on a relationship. They weren't. They may have been, you know, not picking their battles as they should have. You know what I mean? Wanting, fighting too much, not putting in enough effort. I mean, we have somebody here that has been very defensive. Not really focusing on a relationship. The challenge is you know, finding happiness, focusing on the relationship. Ooh, somebody's taking back taking back control, taking back their power, manifesting. Somebody has manifested, somebody has been working hard. They hadn't been. They hadn't been working on a relationship, but now we got somebody here that is willing to do whatever it takes to bring success. 
So we do have somebody who wants success. They have absolutely made some poor decisions, you know. <laughs> Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, now they're working hard. Yeah, now they're putting in effort. They want to put in effort. They want to do whatever it takes. So we got somebody here that is willing to do whatever it takes to bring success to a relationship. They were combative in the past. They weren't focused on a relationship. But now it's like they maybe they see the reason or they see the purpose. Now they're changing their direction or they're changing their focus. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Justice. There's been some unfair treatment. There's been, this is definitely an injustice. Now we got somebody here that is moving in a to a better place. Somebody is moving on. Somebody is moving on. And this is moving as well. So we got somebody here that is taking that passage. It's like they're taking that drive or they're taking that road that they need to take to bring success. This has something to do with being on the road. I don't know where that's coming from. There's been some deception. There's been some dishonesty. There's been some unfair treatment. Somebody wasn't putting in effort. There's a feeling of emptiness. There's a, a feeling of, I'm not comfortable. I'm not happy. I just want to go home. This isn't home to me. It doesn't feel like home, you know. 10, 10, 10 in the world card right here. So we have a completion here, but these tens are reversed. It's like there's a, or there's, a, I think this is like some sort of relationship that has ended, but there's an opportunity to be, bring success. It's like there's an opportunity to change this. There's an opportunity to change the outcome. The magician, as above, so below. This is this is bringing heaven down here. It's like taking action to bring balance. Somebody is trying to bring balance, or they're going to, they're going to try to bring balance back to a relationship. It's like this relationship has been turned upside down. There's been some chaos. There's been some upheaval. We have somebody here that was probably focused more on their work, focused more on everything but a relationship. And that, 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 that focusing on, you know, everything but the relationship has caused the relationship to basically fall apart. Somebody's giving up. Or has given up. But it's not over yet. It's not over yet. This isn't over yet. It's not over. So we have somebody here that is hoping with extra effort and extra hard work that they, they can make it successful. Right here, you know, externally, there's been an injustice. There has been an injustice. There's been some sort of definite imbalance somebody was trying to juggle somebody wasn't was undecided somebody was trying to or they were not being completely honest there's lack of finality here something is not over it's not over yet and we have somebody here that is is finding the resources within themselves To move in a different direction. Definitely. We got somebody here that is moving in a different direction. Um, and it's... Oh, I got to get some clarifiers here. Somebody... This is a journey. Somebody is, is going to be on the road or they're going to they're gonna drive someplace. They're going to get in their vehicle and they're going to go someplace and there could be some sort... Because this is a wheel... I just feel like this has to do with a vehicle. Okay, this really has to do with a vehicle, getting in the car, doing whatever it takes. I got to do whatever it takes to bring justice, to do the right thing. There's been a lack of integrity here. The approach is to get going, get moving.
you know, there could have been some feuding going on. There could have been a family feud. There could have been family that got involved that caused a person to give up on a relationship. You know, family isn't always supportive of what your heart wants. Either way, we have these, these three tens here. This is completion, completion, completion. But these two are reversed. I feel like there's a, there is some sort of relationship that has ended that isn't over. It's not over. It's not over yet. There's lack of closure. There's, there is, there's lack of closure. Um, the fool starting over. Starting fresh. We have a new beginning here. We have somebody here that is about to have a new beginning and start with a clean slate. This person is replacing fear with faith as with the chariot and taking a risk. So we have somebody here that is about to step outside of their comfort zone. They've been trying to stay in a safe situation, you know, but it hasn't been making them happy. And now it's like, it's time for me to go. It's time for me to take this risk. It's time for me to fly. Somebody was acting foolishly. They were acting foolishly. And now they are taking action to start over. So this is starting fresh with a clean slate. Moving on. We have somebody here that has been very self-centered and conceited. Pessimistic, thinking negatively. They may have been dealing with somebody because this is down in your external environment. We have somebody here that was de dealing with somebody. Could have been a parent. Could have been a parent or a sibling. A sibling or maybe even a child. Could have been two people. Family members, because this is the Ten of Pentacles is family. So, and I really feel like family has gotten in the way of this, of a relationship that was meant to be. This is destiny. So I feel as though we have somebody here that is maybe angry, very, very angry and upset that... Something didn't turn out. The outcome didn't turn out the way that they had hoped. Ten of Wands. Damn, we got a lot of tens here. Overwhelmed. We do have somebody that is angry. Somebody that is overwhelmed. Somebody is feeling like this is too much. They can't carry this anymore. They can't hold on to this anymore. Now they're ready to follow their heart. It's like their heart is begging them to follow it. This is not good news. So I feel like we have somebody here that may be receiving news that... Somebody has decided to follow their heart, and in order to follow their heart, they have to, you know, drop something. They have to drop, because this is dropping a weight, dropping a burden. Drop some responsibilities. They have to complete something. They have to let something go. Look at the tens. It's just crazy. Somebody is feeling very, very burdened by carrying this injustice. The justice is down here. They're angry and upset because something, you know, didn't go the way that, that their heart really wanted it to go. And I think that what happened is, is ego and pride got in the way and family got in the way as well. Whether it's your family or the other person's family. There's been some sort of family feuds here. Or family interference. But 
but this this whole relationship scenario it's not over yet because it's like this person has been withholding their love but it's like they can't withhold it anymore and now it's a moment of decision so today is a day of making a decision two of wands somebody is deciding you know do I do I stay where I'm at or do I go back do I go back to what my heart wants do I go back to where it felt successful so we got somebody here that is really really thinking about which path to take We have somebody here that's been feeling very, very restless with how something has ended. And it's like now they have this opportunity. Maybe I think they run into somebody. They have this opportunity to make it right. Whether they run into them or not. This is an opportunity for a new beginning here. Now this doesn't now it, this could also be some this could be starting fresh, starting with a clean slate. Somebody could be being set free from a relationship. Okay? Change in direction. And that is a time of freedom. It's a time of victory, really. It gives you the opportunity to move. So somebody may be being set free from something that really burdened them. Somebody was dealing with a Debbie Downer that really held them down, that really like messed up their relationship. And that's what I see. This is moving away from that negative Nelly. It's not comfortable anymore. I'm ready to start over. Princess of Wands. Yeah, this is this is not a good good match. Somebody has been held back by somebody that isn't well suited for them. But it looks as though there's some sort of some sort of unexpected element of 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 uh, running into a person. You know what I mean? I think I mean the four of wands. This is unexpected as well. I think that we have somebody here that is going to run into somebody that they have some unfinished business with. They probably have a deep bond with this person. This 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 person you may not even even met in this lifetime because there's there's people from your past lives that you come into contact with in this current life that are meant to be in your life at this time for a reason so it could be somebody brand new it could be the four of wands reversed is you know unexpected a relationship is about to become more committed i think there's a commitment coming there could be a recommitment coming i feel like if somebody was probably treated unfairly and there's been some anger I think that we have this person that is angry for about the unfair treatment and there's an opportunity to settle this okay and I feel like there's there's you know a change of course that is coming I think that something there's gonna be a destined meetup that is happening that is meant to be that gives somebody the opportunity to speak from the heart yeah that's what I got so let's get one of these angel romance cards I think that there's an and this could be an upcoming celebration as well somebody may receive bad news okay this is bad news the princess of wands reverse this is bad news that somebody has broken free and that gives them the opportunity to basically fly and be free so you may think that this is bad news but this is all happening for a reason remember thousands of people watch this reading so take what resonates and leave the wet rest 
somebody's going to be receiving emotional support or uh, you know a loving welcome message from somebody that could lead to a commitment um, somebody may leave unexpectedly you know they may leave without closure and it may seem like it may make a person very very angry and upset but it all happened for a reason and perhaps this is the reason maybe you 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 come into contact with the person that you are meant to be with because you know today's the day you know maybe that's what what it is What do we got for the ninth? There's a welcome message of love here. There is. It feels as though we have somebody here that is making a decision to start over. Start over. Heart to heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. There's going to be some sort of talk. There is going to be some sort of talk that opens up a doorway. This doorway could lead to a commitment. It could lead to happiness. It could. It could. Even with the Four of Wands reversed. There's been a lot of chaos. There's been a lot of upheaval. Somebody, it feels like we have somebody here that has experienced a huge It's like a huge change of heart. And they decide to break free from something or a family situation or whatever it is that has held them back from happiness. So I feel like we have somebody, people that it's somebody that is going to, you know, travel towards They're fated, destined, um, person. I mean, that's what it is. It's like there's going to be some sort of traveling that brings two hearts together. And it's meant to be. And that's what I got. Good luck.